Hello YouTube, John here with Ryan Family Farm. I think we're gonna have a nice easy day. Um, I'll show you around all the farm animals. We gotta feed. If you can't hear the pigs in the background there, they're protesting because I haven't fed them yet. Stick around, I'll introduce you to all the farm animals. As you can tell, I've been spreading compost, so a couple of the tractors still sitting out. Pile's almost gone. I don't know, three, four more loads. I want to save some for the uh, garden also, but almost gone. Boy, you guys are noisy this morning. That's Fat Amy, Thick Thelma, and Pig Newton. Amy and Thelma, or Yorkshire Landrace crosses. And old Pig Newton here is a full-blooded Yorkshire. And we can't forget about Gracie Pig. She's still over here. She's still over here. She's not with the others. She got shocked by the fence. She's too scared to leave here, but I'll get in there eventually and get her out. She's fine where she's at for now. Gracie Pig is a purebred Hereford. We can't forget about the barn kitties. There's three of them total. I don't know where the other two are. Hey, if you can, hit that subscribe button for us. 90% of the people that watch our videos aren't subscribed. And I know it's not because of a cuteness factor. Found another barn kitty. Now there's only one missing. Where's the other one? Of course I didn't forget about you guys. But where's your brother? Oh, wait. There he is. You must have been sleeping somewhere. And of course we have the Wagyu up here getting their breakfast. He's still out there. He must not be hungry this morning. What are you guys doing? You sheep or something else. We're gonna walk out in the field and check on the uh, chickens now and see if there's any eggs. We gotta disconnect the electric fence so I can just walk through it that way. We're gonna check on the other moo cows as we go out. Here's the bull. Hey, don't get cocky with me. Today could be the day that I cross that fence and whoop you. You're lucky the fence is on. I turned the fence off, but we don't have to tell him that. Of course the cows are Angus, Angus crossbreed, and there's two purebred Wagyu cows out here. The bull is a registered Angus bull. Good morning girls. You got something to say? All right then. She's got hay, I don't know why she's complaining. What are you doing in the feeding ring? You're not supposed to be in there. Oh, uh, look who I found. I'm 507. No, you can't eat me. They start doing that when they need salt and places were out of salt so I haven't been able to get them any. I may go day and try to get some. Why are you in the feeding ring? Well, I'm scared. I'm running away. Run away! Run away! Run away! <laughs> Those little guys are always so jumpy. Once they get older, a little bit bigger like this, they're not as scared of you. 
Oh yeah, I do have to go through a gate. I forgot I'll latch this. The chickens are always so happy to see me. Hi girls and boys. I usually can't walk because I get under my feet. Oh yeah, I'm a watering drum here. I forgot to glue that. They knocked it off. I'll get that fixed for them here this week. I got a drum with a locking lid I keep their feet in. That way I don't have to carry feet out here. And then when I move the eggmobile, I can just pick that up with the front end loader and take it with us. I generally put some in their feeder, but then I'll spread some out just to encourage them to scratch and spread all this hay and stuff out. We'll see what kind of presents we got in here. Oh, there's two on the ground. Oh, look. There's one, two, five this morning. You never know where these guys are going to turn up. I think my hay situation is going to be okay because I'm feeding a lot bigger bales. Our baler, the main baler we used, went down last year. And we're using our backup and it's not as big and it doesn't wrap them as tight. So I went through those first and I think that uh, now that I'm feeding these bigger bales, I'm going more than seven days. So update on the hay situation, we should be fine. Shouldn't have to haul any from the other farm. Don't be side-eyeing me. I've had this gate open for a week. Hoping Gracie Pig will get brave enough to wander out of there, but she said, no way. I got bit multiple times by the electric fence last time, so she stays in. Got to hook the electric back up. I did not forget about you guys. Don't be swelling up on me. These are, these are bourbon red. I, I can't do this if you keep making noise. These are bourbon red turkeys. Of course, that's the tall and the other two are hens. That concludes the farm tour. I'm glad you guys went along with me for it. That's my morning routine for the most part, and I do it all again in the evening time. I'm John with Ryan Family Farm. I appreciate you watching, and I will see you next time.